Gymnosperms 果子植物 Gymnosperms are vascular plants that produce seeds. However, the seeds of gymnosperms lack the protection of an enveloping structure such as the fruit wall that encloses the seeds of angiosperms or flowering plants. Gymnosperms include such common plants as cycads, zingo, pines, sprouts, firs, hemlocks, and cedars. We are going to study three species, namely the cycad, the Norfolk Island pine, and the dragon juniper, for examples. Cycad, sago palm, feng mei chong, so tit, cycad daisy, so tit four. This is a small palm like tree growing at most to two meters high, with a stout cylindrical trunk. Covered by the persistent leaf bases, bearing a terminal whorl of feather-shaped leaves, cycad is not a true palm, but it has large pinnate compound leaves resembling those of the true palms. Although it is called Feng Mei Chong in Cantonese, it is not related to pine either. The young compound leaves are similar to the feather heads of the ferns, which undergo uncoiling. During development, Norfolk Island pine, Nam Yang Cham, Arakaurisi, Nam Yang Cham Four. Does this plant look like a Christmas tree? This is a handsome evergreen coniferous tree up to seventy meters. The main branches are horizontal in regular rows, and the whole tree is more or less symmetrical. The leaves are clustered as whorls along the axis of a twig. The leaves are simple, short, needle-shaped. Although the twigs are covered by numerous needle-shaped leaves, they are soft and harmless to feel. Dragon juniper, Long Pa, Cupressaceae, Pa Four. This is an evergreen, aromatic tree native to China and Japan, but now it is widespread and extensively grown as a garden ornamental in many countries. At a distance, the whole tree somewhat appears like a Chinese green dragon twining around a pillar. This is why it is called Long Pa in Chinese. The leaves are of two kinds. One kind is short, needle-shaped. Whereas the other kind is scale-like. Both kinds of leaves are arranged in rows along the stem. The presence of these two kinds of a leaf is diagnostic for juniper and makes recognition of this plant a relatively simple matter.